We're going to have our readings now, and Phil brings us uh, our first reading from 1 Peter 2. This morning's reading comes from 1 Peter, and it's uh, chapter 2, starting at verse 4. As you come to him, the living stone, rejected by men, but chosen by God and precious to him, you also, like living stones, are being built into a spiritual house to be a holy priesthood, offering spiritual sacrifices acceptable to God through Jesus Christ. For in scripture it says, See, I lie a stone in Zion, a chosen and precious cornerstone, and the one who trusts him will never be put to shame. Now, you who believe, this stone is precious, but to those who do not believe, the stone the builders rejected has become the capstone, and a stone that causes men to stumble, and a rock that makes them fall. They stumble because they disobey the message, which is also what they were destined for. But you are a chosen people, a royal priesthood, a holy nation, a people belonging to God, that you may declare the praises of him who called you out of darkness into his wonderful light. Once you were not a people, but now you are the people of God. Once you had not received mercy, but now you have received mercy. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. And Joe is going to bring us our gospel reading from Luke chapter 20. Our reading today is from Luke 20, verses 17 to 19. Jesus looked directly at them and asked, Then what is the meaning of that which is written? The stone of the builders rejected has become the capstone. Everyone who falls on that stone will be broken to pieces, but he on whom it falls will be crushed. The teachers of the law and the chief priests looked for a way to arrest him immediately, because they knew he had spoken this parable against them but they were afraid of the people. Our third hymn is Amazing Grace. <laughs> 